To publish your website from iWeb 08 or earlier to your Rage web hosting account, follow these steps. First, open iWeb and publish your site to a folder by going to File and selecting Publish to a Folder. Depending on which version of iWeb you have, your file menu might look something like either of these, but the important thing is to locate the Publish to a Folder option. After you select to publish to a folder, select the location on your hard drive where you want to publish the folder to, and type in your URL if asked to do so. Once the site has been published, you will need to launch iWeb SEO Tool. iWeb SEO Tool is a downloadable desktop application which is available for free to Rage web hosting customers who have signed up to hosting for at least one year. If you are eligible for the free license, be sure to email the Rage support team and let us know. We will provide you with the free license. Once you have launched iWeb SEO Tool, click on the Open Website button and locate your site's folder which you just published from iWeb and load your website. Next, click on the Publish button in the top right corner of the application. Make sure the Publish to FTP tab is selected and click Next. This FTP details window will appear. Here is where we will need to refer to the new account information email that you received when signing up for Rage Web Hosting. Copy and paste the FTP information from this email into its respective field. Make sure that when you are highlighting the information, you do not highlight more than just the text. For example, have a look at how I have highlighted the username. If you notice right at the front of my highlight, there is a blank space. Do not make this mistake, otherwise publishing will not work. Just highlight the string of letters and numbers. This rule applies for all four of these items. Make sure that you do not forget this directory path, which is www. If you forget this directory path, the publish won't work. Now that you have all of the fields entered, check to see if you copied them correctly by clicking on the Browse button. If you are able to see several files and folders, then you have entered it correctly. If you get an error message like this, then you have not entered your FTP information correctly and you should close this FTP details window and try it again. If you did enter your FTP information correctly, before clicking the upload button, I want you to click the plus sign down here and enter a name for this FTP account. This saves the FTP information for you so that whenever you come back to this FTP details window, you do not need to retype everything but rather just click on the FTP account and the FTP information will automatically show up for you. And that is how you publish your iWeb site to Rage Web Hosting if you use a version of iWeb other than iWeb 09. Just one quick note in case some of you are wondering about your URLs. If your URL shows up as what we call the long URL, which looks something like this, but you prefer to have the short URL, which looks something like this, all you need to do is make sure that when you publish the site to a folder in iWeb, that you choose to publish it to your desktop. Publishing the folder to your desktop is the simplest way of ensuring that you will have the short URL.